evening, Hornets fans. We're coming at you with a match tonight against Tater Spyro. Uh, we got a bit here in inducements. It's kind of tempting. I guess we could get a wizard and Eldril. We're kind of short on catchers, so Jordel could be nice. I think I definitely want a wizard. We could just get an apothecary and two apos, but you know what? We're missing so many players to begin with. Let's spend the 10k get get Eldra. It's not that much. Eldra will hopefully help us break cages. We are missing some important players. Um, it's going to be a rough match. We've got a lot of journeymen. At least we're playing in the hornet's nest. I like his cheeky howdy, have fun, no good luck, eh? <laughs> as long as... Uh, As long as we don't have Tasteless jumping in here and uh, calling the 4-1 victory, we should be safe. Because we've only really gotten our butts kicked in matches that he's done that, right? Um, oh, jeez, I haven't thought a whole lot about this. Am I going to kick or receive? Oh, boy. Um... We got so many journeymen. Let's let's feed them to the line. Um, all right, we are on defense. What do we got here? Hey, uh, we actually got the fan factor one there. We got like 14k, he got 12k. Cool. Weather's nice. Um, where's all these loners? He's got enough guard grouping together. I don't think it's really going to help. Cause we got to we got to steal back the ball. That's our ah. But you know what? We're mi yeah. You know what? We're missing our leaper. Maybe I should have grabbed. I don't know. I think Eldril's kind of our guy here. Maybe I should have just received. We don't really have a whole lot to steal back. I didn't think this through very far. I hate to do this because I have to do it one by one, but... Hey, Uber. Thanks. We'll see what we can do here. We're definitely going to need the good luck. We'll most certainly do what we can to kick short, see if we can recover the ball. Because kicking deep is just going to let him buy time. For, or bide his time to uh, 
give me as few turns to score back as possible. And I don't really have much of a one-turn attempt. We're missing our good players. Um, He's got more over here. Let's keep it away from the sure hands. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Yeah, we should have placed it one end just to be safe. Hopefully this doesn't bounce out, but it probably will. It's more than likely it will. <laughs> he also just gets high kick. So, interesting. I guess that's better than a touchback back here, maybe? I don't know. <clears throat> guess that's all right. It's funny, if he just kicks this guy, he can get his cage, like, right here to start. Though, we'd have him pretty pinned then, so that might not be the best idea for him. Guess he's throwing this guy just to make sure he doesn't roll, like, quad skulls here and, uh, the crowd surf the guy. A six for the catch. There's a nice double skulls. Wow. Alright, we, we gotta use this. It's a good thing he put... Okay, uh, can't quite make it there. Do we have anybody else with sidestep? No, we could put Hawk there. Okay. We don't have anybody with leap, so we can't leap there to make it a crowd surf, sadly. I would love to do that, but... Too much to dodge through there. Alright. If we put Hawk on here. <clears throat> we'll have a sidestepper on the side. And... <clears throat> hopefully we'll get the knockdown here. And maybe it'll bounce out and come back to us or something. Okay. We at least got the knockdown. Shit, we came one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <clears throat> Would have caught it. Uh, I've got to step out of here. I mean, I could go mark this guy. That's fine. I'm just going to go here. He could get that ball. One, two, three, four, five. He could get the ball. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. off, I suppose.
Oh my god, what did I do? I moved the catcher. Whoops. Well. That's what I was going to use to do that. Oh well. Why did he fail? I rolled a two. Am I in a disturbing presence range? Oh. Okay, I see where I'm at. I He's agi busted. I forgot about that. All right, what did he say? <clears throat> hey Chinchiro, uh turn turn one's been pretty nuts. Um so I tried to kick short. It, land, it was going to land here. He got a high kick, so he sent this guy down here. He caught it. Um, he moved a guy in to make sure I couldn't uh, crowd surf him. And then he started taking line of scrimmage blocks and uh, rolled a quad skull. So I gazed this guy, brought Hawk in, came in with Durian, knocked the ball loose, uh, and then pretty much just spread out, got the ball with the guy. Um, and I went to hand it off to, so I accidentally moved my catcher out here that I went, meant to grab the ball with cause I was being dumb. Um, but I had another lineman here who could grab it and hand it off to this catcher, but I forgot he's agi busted and he rolled a two and a one to catch. So it fell out of his hands and went into the side of the cage corners hands who just got blitzed. So now you're all caught up. It's been kind of nuts. I mean, it was really fortunate for me that he got the quad skull. Um, and he really, he got it back because um, if I would have not been dumb and sent this catcher over here, uh, he was the guy who was going to pick it up and I was going to send him back here. <clears throat> okay. Okay. Oh, good. This guy's still gazed. Okay, okay. Oh, huh. okay. That's that's fine. Could blitz him off of it. Problem is kind of this guy. Not really an easy way out of there. But we could we could just do this. It's a loner block, so it's kind of risky.
I'll give him the hit. Uh... Stay there, keep that guy marked. It's okay. <sighs> May have to pass to him. Dodge skill works out. Three plus. Mm, I will reroll that. Two plus, all right. Hey, Luke. Yeah, Chinchira. I love seeing games like this. It's just absolutely wild right now. Uh, this is crazy stuff. Okay, so... Alright, he gets the knockdown. It's fine, we're gonna go here. He's not used his blitz yet. Yeah, Grunter. Once we get the ball and get away. Now, sadly, I'm not going to be able to, like, stall or anything, so he's still going to get a lot of time to uh, come back after me. But I will happily take this.
I'd be okay if Eldrill stole the ball. I don't care if he's the one that gets the touchdown. It's fine with me. Still a TD. He's picking how he wants to... Alright, maybe he's gonna blitz with this guy and just do like a one-die hit on Eldra. Oh, no, it's two-die hit, because him. Um, oh, we got the pow. Definitely fend. Come here for now. Close, but not quite. I'd love for this rookie blitzer to get some star player points, but... I'm okay with this catcher getting it, because that means he's going to level. Um, can we hit an important piece real quick? Before running in? Three, four, five, six. Uh, no, it'd still be a two-die block, but... Uh, no, not worth it. I could quad skull. I don't want to do that. I'm just going to run. I'd love to get the mighty blow hit, but overall, if I quad skull, it would be really bad. <clears throat> Alright, I'm cool with that. Um... Suppose let's try it again. It's still a little bit. There's still a little too much time to stall. So, we're going to try this again. Do this? Nah, I feel this will be alright. Yeah. Um. We're going to do it deep. Perfect D helps a little. Maybe. Uh, I mean, I guess. Get away from the killer. Okay, he can still get to the ball this turn. Just like that guy, I'll do it. And I probably should have brought these guys back one square. Well, he followed up, so I guess he's not as open as I thought. Now he's going to take unskilled blocks. That was the reason I put those guys there. Well, I guess he's got that skilled block first. Going for my kicker. And try to break his legs even more. Thankfully, doesn't. It 
Let's see if we can eat up a reroll with this last block. Now nah, you got it. That's okay. Stuns a journeyman. That's all right. Guy without sure hands picking up the ball. It's okay. He gets it. Got to bring somebody back. Yeah. Bring him over to mark this so I don't just waltz on through. Uh, you don't need the back cage. You don't need that cover. That's a waste. I can't get back there. <clears throat> All right. Um, so, I mean, he's out of range. Uh, dodge through, but he's going to have some trouble. So that's what I'm gonna do. So I shouldn't have moved him yet. Depending on how this goes, they could both be very useful. You know what? I'll feed him this guy. Just keep him busy. Make it a one die block. This guy gets here. <laughs> ah, shit. Failed the going for it. Well, I don't know. It's worth the shot, I suppose. That guy right there. No, I don't like that. So maybe I should have stayed there. Then you'd have to go around farther to get that way. Eh, not by much. I don't know if I should have followed that one up. I, 
It's essentially just feeding them a two die block. Hey there, Ancestricide. Good to see you. Yeah, see, and by stepping him up, I'm letting him really box him in. Should have had him one higher and him one higher, but I didn't plan it out far enough. It's okay, we'll see how we can potentially recover from this. I'm not... Things aren't super great back here. So if he does manage, manage to get through... He'll be set. I imagine he's... I'm surprised he didn't use this guy to blitz. Oh, he didn't have the movement. Never mind. That's why. Ooh, nice. Pushes. Though he's just going to feed him to him. Or not. He's got his way through. He's going to cage up here. See how we want to handle this. Hypno gaze could definitely be another way in for one die. This guy's causing us problems. Because <laughs> hypno gazing him, not really. Well, let's stand up. Punch him, hypno gaze. Who do we blitz with? We're out of people to blitz with. Because Hawk's back here. One, two, three, four. Oh, yeah. That'll stop Hawk from coming around. Or will it? Probably should have went there. It's not like tackle mattered. Mm. No, nope, tackle's important. I should have went here because I needed to clear him. Well. Oh, we can't get the hypno gaze on those guys. Keep people busy. Keep people busy. If you can get away, hypnogaze. What's the path? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Not great, but it's doable.
Roll two. Made that. No gaze worked. Now if we went in there though. For the one die. Come on, three plus dodge. You got dodge. All right. That'll do it. What are we looking at here? I'll follow that. One of these two would have been better, but that's all right. Was that smart? Probably not. What I should have done since this guy's already marked. Oh my gosh, why would I do that? I could have dodged away on a 2 plus and um, blocked, blocked this path off better. I think I got excited because I saw a 1 die block <laughs> potential. Yeah, oh yeah, absolutely, Luke. It was better to dodge him there. Uh oh. Yep, because now we got this guy coming for him. So he takes him down on two dice. Tackle can get a blitz. Oh, the tackle can get a blitz on the ball. I didn't even see him coming. But yeah, no, I agree. Uh, I 100% agree dodging him out instead of punching would have been way smarter. Interesting. So... I guess he goes with a Chaos Warrior. I mean, what else does he go with? He can mark next to it unless he wants to. The Chaos Warrior's at E3, so, like, you might as well. Oh, he's stunned. We can't even get the jump up hit to cut, try to get him in there. Well, he's got the reroll for it. He's probably going to grab it. Here's the thing, though. If we lightning bolt, he goes down. Ah, if he gets away, lightning bolts kind of. Yeah. So let's think about this. We lightning bolt. It's probably going to be around here. We're risking a lot on him getting away and hypnogazing.
Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. This is where he wants to be, seven, eight. This is where he can be with a beastman. So he's got, let's try to remove those potential scoring threats. I think we just slow him down here as best as we can. That should eat the tackle hit. Let's see if we can run over and help out with him. Clear him off, bring him back. Run him up. Keep them busy. Okay. We are going to get punched, but these two are going to be busy punching. Going to be busy punching. Unless he dodges away, he's stuck with him. I mean, yeah, they're going to punch you know, punch the shit out of me, but the key thing is we, we limit his potential scoring threats so we can try to mess him up next turn. We're probably going to take some rough hits here, but thanks guys. Yeah. Go Hornets. Absolutely. Come on. Let's see if we can stop this touchdown. I'm so, uh, my blood's pumping. I'm hoping we don't get more than, like, stuns or KOs here. We can just tie up more players. Yes, this guy's... Well, ooh, even this guy's blocking. 
so one, two, three, four, five. That's even better. Ah, uh, he's gonna do the blitz there. All right, cool. He's spending his killer blitz on a journeyman, so that's cool with me. I wonder if he just realized he's got to bring guys forward and he's blocking his path. Okay. It's fine. So what do we got now? Two KOs and it's two journeymen. Acceptable losses. Now, will he dodge away or will he take the hit? Right, the Chaos Warrior needs 4 GFI to score. But what if he does like a handoff? Can he? Is there anybody he can safely handoff to? Maybe. Okay, he's hanging out there. Uh, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. He can be a scoring threat. He won't. No, he does. Cool. His reroll's used up. Ooh, but he knocks down our important player. Ooh. Okay. That's fine. We don't have to sack the ball. It's, it's funny as a fireball there would be. Uh, we don't have to do it. Uh-oh, Tech Buzz. Techie, you're getting knocked down. And you're niggled. Ooh, sorry, Tech Buzz. I don't think he's in the stream, so. <laughs> no, Nobody tell him to go back and watch the stream. Make sure he, he doesn't see this happen. <laughs> Luke, I like the chant, and I... But did you see, I don't know if you saw the fireball from last game, but I, I did a highlight of it. Uh, it was, it was horrible. Um, so in reality, I could run up, like I could get a hit on this guy. I just, there's not much of a point. Um, here's the thing. So, one, two, three, four, five. No, he's got one turn. Um, not two. So, this is the only scoring threat. Am I right? Yeah, if I stop this guy, we're good. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. Okay. It's fine. Cause you know what we're gonna do. We're gonna hit no gaze him. Shit.
Okay. He could... Let's that way. As long as nobody's here, right, he can't... Put someone there and then push him out. So we can't stand up here. All right, well, I, I had some thoughts there, but I had to roll some dice to get it. I mean, if you put a guy here, he could, like, work something out here. This is, I mean, this isn't super difficult. It's three plus, four plus. It is a five plus catch. He has no reroll and a three plus dodge out. He could do it though. <sighs> Maybe it was the time for the lightning bolt. I don't know. I just, I thought I could. I could have used the lightning bolt to end the turn. Yeah, that him fa failing the gaze was kind of big there. And the four dice not knocking him down was kind of big. Um, yeah, Scorpion, hey. I, uh, was able to steal the ball early on thanks to a quad skull that he had. Ooh. Playing against, uh, the, it's, it's the, um, the butterfly playoff, right? Oh, hey, look at that. He, uh, he failed his dodge. Cool. Yeah, you're right. Better to dodge and pass in the end zone, Luke. That's what he's trying to do, but it didn't quite work. Um, you know, I just realized he... By lining up on... That guy couldn't score, but by lining up on him, he gave me the chance to. Well, I mean, I'd have to get the ball first, and that's not going to happen. So, hit stuff. <laughs> Minus one, plus one. Yeah. He's got guard. Can't really do a whole lot. Um,. Let's just do the thing that doesn't take a lot of dice rolls. Okay. Now, the idea was tempting to lightning bolt the ball carrier, try to grab it with my catcher and pass it to that lineman once I pushed him out, but I doubt it would have happened. Statistically average, but I'm pretty sure we just got our two journeymen, which I definitely would have taken the other two. Yeah. Sucks we don't have Durian, but that's okay. We are receiving, which is good. Um, really, even if, if we score quick, that's that's okay. 
he'll presumably have enough time to score, but... Good luck on your game, Scorpion. I will say, that so far, this game feels like it's going better than the game I had against you in your chaos last week. Though, it was going pretty well against you. And my, I, I felt like it was, a, it was going pretty well until turn seven then you <laughs> then you absolutely destroyed me after that and so far we've made it to we're gonna make it to turn nine so oh wow well good luck with your match that would be super cool to uh be in a playoff spot um i want to hit that guy He's not going to give me an easy way through. Hmm. But we could always just run up and like... Eh. It's not particularly what I want to do. It's not very protected against a blitz. You know what? Even if we hit this guy, what are we going to do? Run up here and get trapped? Yeah, let's just... Let's take our line of scrimmage hits. I think I'm okay with the riot, as long as things don't go horribly. So you can get there, fall back to there. Let's start by punching some things. Nice. You just hang out there, you punch him. Not really gonna have much of a blitz. Nice.
Maybe just taking this block is stupid. Nope, it got him. Okay, okay. Cool. He's coming for him. Uh oh. Armor, armor held. Go hawk. Hmm. Not much of a way through. I suppose we just kind of fall back. I don't, I don't know. Oh, he's got guard there. So much for the jump up hit. Yeah, if I put him here, then he could jump up hit. It'd be a one die. Yeah, that's risky. Run over this way. So basically to L drill, but how far? Try to jump back to there. Bam. Take a two die block there. That'll be cool. Bring him back to there. That could be a blitz. We can run over and help here.
should have did it in the other order because I would have rerolled on him to get him around there and then bring him in to shield him. This is still an alright result. I'm okay with this result. Yeah, Luke, absolutely. Hawk is is a, a very old player. He's he's been in a lot of games. He's definitely the oldest player I've ever had. I really need to wear his jersey more often when I'm I'm streaming. Not that you guys can see or anything. But I do have a Hawk jersey that my wife made. And I I definitely don't wear it as often as I should. Good luck with your match, Scorpion. Thanks for tuning in while well, you did. Yeah, it would have been better off that guy was just still standing there. Should have did it in the other order. Ooh, interesting blitz. I didn't expect that. Yeah, dodge paying off. Huh. I forgot about that guy being so fast. I didn't see that coming. There's a little part of me that hopes he leaves Eldril alone. Cause I will absolutely give the ball to Eldril. Oh, good. That guy just got pushed. Watch me. I will score on Eldril. Him busy. Ooh. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. And we can't really get far enough away. I mean, we could go there and then we could block him. It's doable. That's doable. Could just give the ball to Eldra. Run up through there. Right, but then who do we blitz? We don't, we give it to him, we dodge out that way. It ain't perfect, but I don't hate it. Do I do something with Eldril first? I won't have to make the dodge if I do this. Puts Eldril in harm's way, but... Ri you know what I should have done? Should have came up and hypnogazed him. Because if this goes south, that's really bad. Oh shit, that's an intercept chance. Hey, he leveled. <sighs> he 
goes here, he could assist with the block. Goes here. Could bring him around. Then what do we use for a blitz, really? Oh! Okay. Those people. Hawk, what can you do? What can you blitz? He'll clobber him, he can get out of there. I don't know if that was particularly smart. It might have been smarter to just do two go for it and mark this guy. Probably would have been the smarter thing, but. <laughs> yeah, classic double skull and a double pow. Let's see. Yeah, we're, we're not really safe yet, not even close. Um, luckily, he doesn't have tackle on this guy. So he's going to punch him. I'd love it if it was just pushes. But if it is a knockdown, he's going to get a two-die block. But he doesn't really have any recovery. Sure, hands go. I was gonna say if if he gets the knockdown here, the sure hands go might try to might be able to pick it up. Uh, yeah, so he takes the both down. Let's hope for a blitz down here. Ooh, KO'd. Nice hit. All right. Okay. Um, he's got a 75% chance of getting that. No, why would you go there? Interesting. Who are you gonna pick up with? Just gonna leave it. That's fair. I mean, who am I going to pick up with? And if he failed, I'd have a better chance of getting out of there. Eldril, buddy. I don't know. We, we're losing players quick. Um, and he's definitely got time to get the ball back and tie things up if we don't score. Not good.
too much tackle. Two, three, four, five, six. Uh, he can't really make it. Problem is, him hitting is likely going to end up in just a push. It's not going to be great. I, I don't have dodge. So tackle didn't really matter. Just mark him. Here we go. One, two. Just going to go right here for right now. Because he's got other guys he could bring up to mark. And this is the guy I don't want getting the ball. You know, he can just stay here and mark him. I don't see any major point in doing that. Yeah, okay. No, it's all good, Luke. Yeah, so the... I don't know if I explained it out loud. I was thinking very hard. But my point for pushing him back... At, like, going here instead of going this way is because he was there, so it was the 3+. plus. Though, would that have gotten me farther? 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. No, would have been the same. I did have thoughts of like bringing this guy up so Hawk could get a two die on him and then this guy could get a two die blitz on him, but this guy just had block and dodge. So like if I didn't roll a pow, I was picking up on a tackle zone. But that was my, my thought process there. I'd love to have this ball on uh on Hawk, just having the dodge and fend would be really helpful, especially because his tackle piece is marked. I guess this guy can find a way up there, but Hawk with his Agi 3, it's just, just a liability. Hey, look at that. Dodge saves the day. This guy can still 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. No wrestle, though. So tackle doesn't matter. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, this guy is literally... This is his first game, I think. Oh, he does have a wrestler that can come through. This is a smart... Um... Ugh, 
it's tempting to let it go out, but it could end up so many bad places. Ooh, okay. He'll have to make the dodge. He's got the dodge skill. What I should have done, I didn't even really see that wrestler as a possible threat, but I should have had this guy dodge out and mark the wrestler. Would have been the smarter thing to do, in hindsight. At least this guy's not stunned. Hawk's not even marked yet. This guy's got... Well, if he moves him here, yeah. So M. Theron's going to have a tough time. If he picks up the ball... I mean, I think a lightning bolt. I think my lightning bolt's coming either way. He's just marking. You know, it would have been smarter to do the dodge than to go for it. Because he had a built-in reroll. Okay. So here's the thing. We can't really go there. We can't really come up here. Not a lot we can do. But we could blitz... Ooh. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ooh. I think at that point the two plus dodge is just. You should go for it, right? Or maybe I should have used the, the lightning bolt and then I wouldn't have had to roll. I don't know why I didn't do that. It was dumb. So, two plus or punch. And a two plus. It's not really helping. All right, two plus, two plus. Come on, pick up that ball. You did it. Nice. Whoo! And a TD on him. There we go. KO wake-ups have been perfectly statistically average this entire game. Yeah, this is great. Um, Nymthron, you get line duty over Durian. Here's the thing. Two turns, two rerolls, and a wizard. Even if he scores, we still win. So I, I kind of feel like I might just go in for the uh, for the score. No, let's let's kick deep though. See where this ends up. It's fine. I guess he's got three turns, technically, so. You know, we still got our Apo. I bet you we could have saved uh, Tech Buzz. back to him.
not the legs. I think you are tasteless, but I'm pretty sure if you say 4-1, Hawk's gonna die or something like that, so... Don't you dare. <laughs> However, uh, I did call it at the beginning of this game that if you didn't jump in and call 4-1, we'd get a win. And it happened. It has consistently happened that the games that you have not called 4-1 victories for me, uh, I have, I have won. <laughs> Every single one you've you've started by calling a 4-1 victory, I have horribly lost. I did. Uh, Hawk punched the dirty player. Fractured his arm. Ooh, another double skulls. Got his pal in the end, though. He's getting tons of stunts. He cannot get a casualty. I mean, he's gotten plenty of KOs, and he did kill Tech Buzz. So it's not like he's gotten nothing, but... I guess it's because he hasn't really gotten a ton of really bad injuries on my players. Hasn't felt like it mattered. Oh, cool. Failed the pack up. Tasteless actually leveled up. With a pass this game. I don't have the reroll anymore, so I'm afraid I'm going to fail this. He's going to get the ball and throw it up, so I'm just going to end the turn with a lightning bolt. I arguably should have started the turn with that, um, and I think I meant to, but I moved my blitz here, and I was like, oop, forgot the lightning bolt first. He can still set things up for a, uh, a pass next turn. Keep some scoring threats. Send at least this guy back so he can pick it up and throw it next turn. Keep a guy in the middle. Or I guess pick it up, hand it off, run up, throw. He 
Is he going to go for the three die block on Hawk? No, if he was, he would have did it with this guy. Tasteless armor holds up. He's going to get that ball, and he's going to give it to him. Um, can't do it if that guy's there. I'd love to hypnogaze this guy instead, but... We could do the dodge. Uh, it doesn't matter. He's got tackle. Okay, hypnogaze. 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 He's got to get the ball, and he's got to get it into him, so... Right, yeah. Three plus pass. He rolled a four. He did it. Oh my gosh. That was crazy. Oh, cool. It's statistically average every time. It's impressive. <laughs> this guy's just... He's like, I'm done. Man, I, got, I broke my neck last... The other game... I'm done. Um,
I do that backwards. I think this guy's supposed to be over here or something. And then. No, maybe I did that right. I don't know. I forget which side is supposed to have two people. But, either way, that ends up uh, being either a 3-0 or a 3-1. Suppose we could see a riot. He didn't even really set up for a one turn. That's fair. I wonder if he'll do the vanity pass. We didn't use our Apo either. I suppose he's got a blitz still. A foul if he wants it. Is that guy like 2 XP away from leveling or something? I think he just wants more SPP on him. Ooh! He got the KO. I already told him good luck. All right, he got the pickup. Can he get the vanity pass? Yeah, he does. Nice. Cool. Three zero victory. Uh, I I credit this victory to tasteless not calling a 4-1 uh, victory. Pretty good. Oh, look at that MVP. I don't know if I like that or not. I mean, it's cool that he leveled, but also he's agi busted, so he's not really all that much longer for the team. You got lots. I mean, we got a ton of SPP. You got lots of blocks. That's true, Tasteless. He could roll Agi up, and then I, I guess he's still got a spot on the team? I don't know. That's a lot of TV. He's probably still getting fired. Um, yeah, I mean, our armor held up pretty well. That was, that was big. Injury was pretty good, too. If we had some nice pickups, I know most of them weren't super difficult, but still, that helped. I mean, our, yeah, our, our dice were, were pretty good. They weren't, like, crazy spectacular, but they were pretty good. Um, for Chaos Team, that's not great armor. Even though I was hitting them with Mighty Blow a lot of the times. But I did. Yeah, I did. By about 10%. Yeah, that's that's huge. That pro elf armor. What are the block dice? Ooh, he rolled quite a few skulls too. Yeah, I think his dice were below average for sure. Oh, 
come on, server. No, don't do some timeout thing. Okay, cool. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no problem, Tasteless. Gotta get rid of those dirty players. Really, I'm just saving that beast man from uh, going under the Book of Grudges for your dwarf team. If anything, I did that beast man a favor. Ooh, we got all these levels up. Let's... While Tasteless is here, let's see what your level up's gonna be, Tasteless. Ooh. You did say Agi up. You said it for the other guy, but I guess this means... Do you take Agi up on a pro-off thrower? I've never had this opportunity before. I mean, I mean, I think you do. Yeah, obviously, because it helps th throw farther. Yeah, absolutely. Agi up. Yeah. See, I'm so used to somehow rolling doubles and getting strong arm first. I had to think about it for a second. Because my immediate thought went to, well, it doesn't help me pick things up. It doesn't help me dodge away. What else could a thrower do aside from picking up the ball and dodging away? You know. Oh yeah, throw the ball. Yeah, it does help with that. <laughs> uh, let's see what this guy gets. Hold on. What do I? What do I have catcher wise? I got Thantledow, so he's the block one. And I've already got two Rackle ones. Though I'm probably getting rid of a Rackle one. So let's see what he gets, and we'll see what the other guy gets. Okay, just like an average thing, so it's gonna be wrestle or block. Let's see what Durian gets and decide how close he is to leaving the team. You fucking called it, man. Holy shit. Huh. I mean I feel like I gotta take it. But team value wise. It's really going to skyrocket it. I don't really need more strip ball. I already have a strip ball piece. I'm not taking leap on an Agi 3. So yeah, I guess I might as well just take the Agi 4. I can't believe you called that. That was that was uncanny. Everything you call comes true, except for your 4-1 victory things. Those are just... It's like some weird code for the Hornets are going to have a horrible game. But it comes true. Seeing if there's anything else I'd particularly want. Nah, I mean, it's it's agi up. Gets him back to normal. Uh, I guess that means this guy takes block. Because we've got two guys who are focused on sacking. And then two people who can be focused on scoring. Though Thantletas is kind of focused on pushing back stand firm big guys. true i could take shadowing on this guy with just dodge um yeah so we're looking pretty all right here um we've got all four catchers again but uh, it's just a hard choice if we save up to replace durian or not i don't know maybe we're gonna keep him for next game i think i don't know if we want to buy another lineman though let, let's see who the heck we're playing. Oh, yeah, we're playing Cha-Cha Slide. So, what's his... 1780. Uh, ugh. Painful. Does he have any sure hands? Oh, yeah, he does. Yeah, but this guy's so slow. So 1780, and we're looking at 1690. But also, we're getting to, yeah, we're going to be giving up inducements, probably. You know what? I don't think I'm going to spend this cash yet. I'm going to save it, 
see where we end up end of season if we want to replace Durian or not. Because even if we bought a new lineman, like, it's just fodder against the Chaos Dwarves. So, hey, <laughs> look at that. Because the week's not up, this is the last time we'll see uh, fifth place for the Hornets. Um, but yeah. Wow. I, Tater Spyro was really up there. Then all of a sudden, he just kind of dropped. Interesting. I think there's a, a butterfly off going on right now. Uh, I wonder if that's being streamed. Let me, let me see if it is. Blood Bowl. Um, Heroes playing, but I don't see... Yeah, I mean, I would say it's casting time, but I, I have some other things I need to attend to tonight, sadly. My my cutoff time is 9.30, uh, so I while I could cast it for eight minutes, uh, I think I'm just going to throw you guys over to Hero. <laughs> um, but I hope the butterfly off goes well. Um, yeah. Yeah. All right, so let's go ahead and raid Hero. Yep, there we go. All right, thanks for tuning in, everybody. Hope you have a good night. See ya.